Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So in today's session, we are going to see how you can actually convert the SQL Server Management Studio theme to the dark theme. However, if you see when you go to the tools, options, uh, inside this theme drop down, you do not see the dark theme. So the question is how actually we can set this uh, color theme to the dark for this uh, SSMS, okay? Actually, we have to change something in the file. So let me show you how you actually you can do it, okay? So let's go to your drive, okay? And uh, let's go to Windows C where you have installed your SSMS, okay? And then you have to go to this program files, uh, x86. And here you need to locate your SSMS, okay? So this is my SSMS. Let's go inside this. Here you have to select common 7 and here inside this uh, folder you have to select ID. So here guys you have to search for the file uh, that has extension of uh, dot package and def okay. So this is the file where we need to make a change in order to get the dark theme okay. So you just need to right click here and you can open this with any of the ID that is available in your system and you can make a change there okay. Or you can directly edit this with uh, notepad plus plus or notepad okay. The only key thing is uh, you need to have the admin access okay. So you need to go to the bottom of the file if you see remove dark themes okay. So you need to comment this line 463 I mean it can be a different line number for you. So you need to comment this uh, out okay. So let's comment this out. It will ask you to launch this notepad plus plus in admin mode. So let's click on yes. Now we can save it here okay. After saving let's close this file and let's uh, go back to the folder again and let's click on the date modified okay so that we can see which is the file which is recently modified so if you see it is showing it is modified on today date uh, 8 15 okay so i can match this with the system time so that's fine now if you come to the ssms again you will not be seeing that option so for that you have to close your ssms and launch it again okay or you can say you have to restart it so let's do that now i'm restarting my ssms again If you see, this has directly started with the dark theme, but I can show you the options in the drop down. Okay, let's go to the options. And if you see the color theme, we do have the dark option now. Okay, so that is the reason it has started with the dark theme because that was the top option, I believe. But even if it's not started with the dark theme, you can always select this dark theme from here and then you can click on OK. So you can query here something and see how it is appearing. Okay, so you can see the color code. Similarly, you can write something like this. So that's pretty much guys. Uh, I hope you might have liked the video. If that's the case, please do not hesitate to subscribe our channel. We'll meet up in the next video. Till then, bye bye. Take care.